Chairman of the Antigua and Barbuda Electoral Commission, Juno Samuel, says a great deal of preparation has been done to date as the commission gets set for polling day. Is that the ballots have to be printed and now that we know who the candidates are, we can proceed with that process. Uh, the other important issue is the distribution of the cards. We're going along, we know that there are hiccups, and as they are drawn to our attention, we are remedying these situations. The ABEC chairman, when asked about measures being put in place to prevent the late start of polls as occurred in the 2009 general elections, had this to say. I want to assure you that this commission is not going to have any late starts. <laughs> it's not going to happen. And that is why we want to make certain that everything that is to be done will be done and is being done. Right now, we have all the paper, we have the ink, we have the ballot boxes, that's an example of one. We have the screens, we have the trainers, the, the, we have trained the people who are going to be working in the polling districts. We have the returning officers, they're all ready to go. Uh, we're now giving out the cards and that's why we want the cards to be um, given out within the next week and a half. And we are now in the process of looking about the printing of the ballots and that will be in the hands of Grant Thornton. They will be the, 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 this will be the company that will be supervising the printing. Of he says the commissioners have visited some of the sites where the cards are being distributed and wherever they see that there are problems, the commission, along with the supervisor of elections and the staff, will be ironing them out. Supervisor of elections, Lorna Simon, also reassures the general public that everything will be in order on polling day. Supervising 2009, those issues that caused the late start, we don't have those issues this year. So I can guarantee the public that everything should be in place days before the poll. Deputy Chairman Nathaniel Paddy James also addressed the various infractions relating to the electoral process. Assistant to the Supervisor of Election, Ian Hughes, conducted a demonstration with the ballot box that will be used on Election Day and explained the process in taking it from the polling station to where the ballots will be counted. Alcina Titter reporting for ABS News.